we are detecting objects via YOLO V8 that is for our object detection. We have trained our own model for mascot and car and traffic lights, stop signs and everything. Uh, while even if we detect the object, we need to know where the object is placed at what distance from the camera. So for that, we are using depth estimation. We are using MobileNet V2 uh, for detection of depth. We are starting the bot to move from uh, the house towards the fire station. Now as bot can see the truck, it is uh, starting to avoid it. Now it can see the stop sign, so that's why it has stopped. Now it is reaching a turn. Oh, now as it has seen a red light, it has stopped. As you can see from a very far distance, it is able to detect that this, this is a traffic light. And after that, it also detects as if it is a green, red or uh, yellow. Given a problem, we need to solve it and this time we de it depends on our own. So we got to know much more insights of a problem. We find out the whole solution with the guidance that we had and uh, finding a solution doesn't only mean that uh, it should work, It should you should know the previous basics out of it and everything you should know out because why it is happening. Raspberry Pi is uh, one of the latest maths used in the industry. Still there were uh, no drivers available for driving a motor via ROS on a Raspberry Pi. When you do not find a solution, you make one. We designed our own driver. That's the thing you can do. Like. At, uh, you can go into the core of electronics and find any solution out of it. We are thinking of writing the research paper on our own project. Developing something that was no, never before, that R&D, that feeling that keeps on with you and you feel that I need to do, a, you do that again and again. Consistency and resilience is most important. Every time you face a problem, you don't give up and you work harder and you work your way around the problem. When we were having with some industrial expert or some professor, they told us the other way of doing it. When you had only three minds on a project and when you get 30 minds on a project, you get different aspects of doing the same thing. Uh, one of the people who witnessed the projects told us about a new business or startup idea that it could be done from the project. And we had never imagined it could be seen in a way like that. Last year, I was working as an intern in a company. I was not able to get the whole sight of how to do it because there was not so much guidance there. Here I get the perfect guidance how to do it. That guidance Yantra can only do it. It's a feast of knowledge. If you are not the smartest person in the room, you are in the right room. We were uh, sitting around a bunch of people, those who have greatest knowledge in robotics. From that you learn a lot. When you meet the best, you become better. You are a, a caterpillar and you become a butterfly. That's the starting of Vintra. From there, it's starting to fly, fly high. Then get there are clouds. You need to get low when it rains. You need to again get to your aim. You need to complete it. At that point, there is a threshold. Like you start flying so high at a moment that you cross the cloud. You fly like a, like an eagle that you can't stop. That's the kind of call Vintra can give you from starting from EYRC, complete come coming here as an. EYSIP intern that changed our whole course of robotics.